Hello everyone, welcome to the channel Rad here from Radko Tarot and this is going to be Taurus Sun, Taurus Moon and Taurus Rising weekly tarot reading for August 13 to August 19, 2018. So this is going to be a four card spread and on the end of, these, of the tarot reading I will also incorporate a Lenormand reading in this video for Tauruses for this particular week. So the first card which represents the topic for Tauruses is going to be here. Then second card uh, represents the core of the situation for Tauruses for that week. Third card resembles the uh, challenges to be taken on for Tauruses. And the last one shows up what is the guidance from Tarot for Tauruses to follow into that particular week. So uh, let's see what we got here. Now the topic of the week for you guys that is going to be the Six of Pentacles. So this card shows that they are contradicting factors into your career and into your relationship will be in present which are going to uh, uh, make a, a very uh, harmonious in, in, in an atmosphere in which you are going to thrive and is going to give you the prerequisite of growing either career wise or either relationship wise so uh, things I mean the unit with that card let's say that the universe is taking care that everything is going to go totally normal in your life there won't be any extremes neither into the positive neither into the negative sides and as one life we know is all about growing so you have any every prerequisite and every mean here means here to uh, to take advantage of and to start growing either career wise or either relationship wise and as we do have the six of pentacles the first th uh, the first thing that you need to start from is by resolving a, a certain undertaking issues that are yet remaining unresolved um, <clears throat> from some previous weeks or previous month in this particular week. Then the second card represents the uh, core of the situation here. This is going to be a woman that we do have now, the Queen of Wands, and she is taking care of that things aren't going very extreme with you and with your things, so that will be a supervisor into your career that every time that something is about to screw up, uh, now she is uh, stepping on or it could be as well a co-worker co she's stepping on and is kind of like diminishing the crisis before the crisis actually start so um, it will be wrong from your behalf if you think that this is a, a faithful supporter it is not now this woman sees benefits in you I mean benefits for her behalf she has a use from you and that's why she is on your side right now but she's very independent and very singular all right and as soon as you don't serve her any favor I mean not that she's gonna screw you over but she will stop supporting you so uh, it, it will be wise for uh, from your behalf to take advantage of that right now she needs you for something that could go as well in relationship or in career you know that could be the mutual friend here into your relationship that is trying to uh, kind of get you and your person of interest or a friend or a boyfriend or a girlfriend uh, closer to one another so you can settle some disagreements as we can see here as the things are going to be in a uh, a balanced contradictory uh, due to the duration of the week for example um, <clears throat> let's say it's a relationship and if your partner is mad to you uh, for is mad on you about something uh, for that for, th for that week um, and an information will appear which is going to kind of like prove them wrong to a certain extent and they're going to realize that they are not exactly right to be uh, to punish you that way and to be mad at you to that extreme extent just an example here then the challenges to be taken on here is that we do have the ace of cups and as we said this is going to be a normal week a normal week is going to be and 
and maybe you are not used to have such a fluent and such a um, um, a steady kind of like development maybe you Tauruses are uh, used to have you know spikes here and there of activity of inactivity etc etc but this week as it's going to be uh, ex extremely fluent and extremely you know calm and peaceful in which you now have a time to catch up your breath and to grow in generally slowly but steady that will be the problem for your behalf you know to make something of your amusement as there won't be many things to amuse yourself with because you know everything will be as I said lingering on a, a balancing scale and if you go to one side of the scale you're going to disrupt the balance creating a distortion the support drops off and you're back to square one so it will be rather very um, wise from your behalf you know just to squeeze your teeth and make the most out of it that it is coming in your way instead of trying to create your means now you do have your means it will be best to take use of them instead of trying to create new one that is what the ace of cups here is telling to us and the last one represents the guidance and it is exactly what I said just right now, you know, to make use of all the means that you do have at this very moment instead of trying to create. Now, this card also points that it will be very wise for you to start planning something big, you know, and especially if we're talking about your personal life, that card shows that it is time uh, finally for you to step outside on the uh, in the world and show uh, that you are ready to receive happiness. It is about working out and uh, working out what you do have on your behalf and it is about the the eight the eight of pentacles it is about slow and steady approach by uh, uh <clears throat> kind of like uh, taking into matters the um the small details you know attending to the small details into one job and into one relationship and this is what is going to make you thrive now uh, the Lenormand reading here uh, is we do have the anchor with the child with the stork. All right, so these cards are pointing for a, a birth of a child in case, uh, you know, you are waiting for your termin. You know, I think, or terminal or whatever is called in English, you know. But uh, these cards are pointing in case you are uh, expecting a, a birth to happen uh, with you or in your family or someone that you do know. You need to know that the birth is going to be successful and the child is going to be uh, healthy. These are what these cards are pointing. There won't be any complications in it. Also, they could speak for conceiving, all right? So if you uh, want to conceive uh, this week, uh, the chances are very big. Uh, if you're trying, of course. But the very literal sense of those cards are pointing the a hope and stability, which breed innocence and uh, openness, are going to be finally delivered. So it all comes to this woman here, you know, and attracting her as a, um, a valuable ally and taking advantage of that he needs he needs you right now to resolve those these issues that are undertaking at this very moment into your environment here in the six of pentacles which are disturbing your longevity uh, and uh, stability longevity and stability so that being said Taurus says this was your weekly tarot reading for august 13 to August 19, 2018. I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it. And in case you're interested in a private reading with me, everything you need to know about it will be listed down there in the description of this video. Rat signing out now. See you next time. Bye.